grieve in Miami, grieve in all the United States and uh, all over the world. My name is Orlando Valido, Oli Valido, or Pimp Oli that they call me here on YouTube. Uh, today we're going to talk about another country music artist, and uh, this one is from the past, I guess. Uh, let me show you the picture of him, but not before. I ask you to like, subscribe to my channel that will help me a lot with the mission. Okay? Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Okay, here is the first picture of him, and the second picture of him. And the name of this artist is Junior Brown. Okay, let's read over here his autobiography for you guys. Uh, his real name is Jameson Junior Brown, was born on June 12, 1952. He's an American country guitarist singer. He has released 12 studio albums in his career, and started twice on the Billboard Country single search. Baum was signature of the instrument, Gil Steel, double neck guitar, hybrid, electric guitar, lap steel guitar. Uh, Gilt is a G-U-I-T steel double neck guitar, okay? For those of you, uh, they did not understand me. Life and career. Brown was uh, born in Cottonwood, Arizona in the early, at the early age, the family moved to, to Kirkville, Indiana, K-I-R-K-S-V-L-L, Indiana. He first learned to play piano from his father, Samuel Ammons Brown Jr. Before I could talk, his music career began in 1960 as he worked through the decades of the next singing and playing piano guitar and guitar for the group Church as the last mile rumble, Dusty Drape and the Dusty Billy Spear, has sleep at the wheel while developing, developing his uh, guitar skill. In the early 1980s, he appeared on the stage with Frank on fire. As a replacement, replacement of the Alejandro Escobedo. However, it did not feature any recording by the band. By the mid-1980s, Brown was teaching guitar at the Hank Thompson School of County Music at Roger State University in Claremont, Oklahoma. 1985, Brown created a new type of double neck guitar with some assistance from Michael Steven. Brown called the instrument hitting guilt steel guitar. When performing, Brown played the guitar by standing behind it while the rest of the small music stand. At the top of the neck, guilt steel is a traditional six string guitar, while the lower neck is a full size lap steel guitar. First line, Jane Brown had two years still for the recording and live work. The original instrument double old yellow as a standard of six string guitar. The person on the neck pickups from uh, Brown previous day guitar. Fender Bullet and the second gear still then the big red as the neck they say goodbye from the bullet neck. 
button in addition. The electric guitar pickup was standard a uh, left steel guitar next used to a uh, identical show but uh, S H O B U D lap steel pickup. There's a pocket on the upper belt for the guitar to hold slide about when it's not in use. One also commission a pedal gear steel with an add pedal instrument for more musical musical control. Brown has started it. the invention of the gear steel was over to mother for convenience so that he could play both lap steel leg guitar doing live performer and not directly motivated by a desire to be one man band. Oh well, yeah, one man band. And I think that a lot uh, in my last night. Brown quickly became a local success in Austin Tester at the Hard Band Continental Club. His debut album was Twelve Shades of Brown in 1990 and released a British demo record or was released or we released in 1993 at the Cup Record and the United States followed by Guilt with, with It. Guilt With It. In 1996, Brown released Semi Crazy followed with a long walk back in 1998. 1996, Brown was featured on the Beach Boy. Now our print album, Star and Stripe, volume number one, on performer cover of the 1962 hit 409, and the song Fisher Brown playing guitar, singing lead with the Beach Boy, singing harmony, and backing vocal. Interesting. Brown appeared in the music video. Honky Tonk song by George John in 1986 also won the CMA Country Music Video of the Year Award for this video. My wife think you're dead. My wife think you're dead. Wow, what a title. Uh, with a feature six foot seven inch Guanling. Uh, this one I had to spell for you. G W E N D O L Y N G I L L I N G H A M. Brown play at the Camille for in day and drive for in drive. And the second episode of uh, season six, the Atfire. Brown music showcase of a various television series, movie soundtrack, including me and myself, Irene, and Spunk Bob, Square Pant, and Square Pant, and the 2005 Duke of Hustle we make, which also play at uh, Nile Radio. Oh yeah, I remember that. Duke has my favorite TV show too. How to Brown played such neo traditional country style honky tongue western swing. I said the uh, summer is a uh, performer with a uh, finish with some of blue and that Mike T S M E S to play as well a soft rock. Instrumental. Interesting. Beginning on August 2006, Brown joined the Web Rider Tour American Manor League Baseball Stadium. He replaced the world of the world of Hurt, H U R T B C, of Adult Swim, Javier 
renegade angel created by Rock and Bar Rock and Band PFF in April 2008, Bomb Shoot 3 pilot episode for the country music program Mother. After a program from uh, the early 1960s, Richard Brown will play with the house of band as well as the guest host for the show. On October 12, 2012, Brown released the AP volume number 10 containing six new songs. AMC preview the video song Better Call Saul S A U L Better Call Saul on October 5th, 2014, on May 24th, 2018, Brown released his 11th album Deep in the Heart of Me. Deep in the Heart of Me. On October 6, 2019, Junior Brown gives still guitar along with his wife, Senator Acosta Guitar, was reported stolen from the vehicle park at the hotel in North Antibobo. Uh, there was a T D L E B O R O. Massachusetts, near the province of Rhode Island. Brown has a wife I've been in the area visiting relatives at that time. On May 27, 2020, Rolling Stone magazine listed 50 contributions every rock fan she owned. On Brown, U.S. release of album 12, Shady Brown, Cup Record, 1993. On May 2020, a hit wife began hosting series of a live Facebook concert under the name The Junior and Tanya Ray Brown Show. Again, Junior and Tanja, Ray Brown Show. Tanja was spelled T-A-N-Y-A. A raise will be R-A-E. For those who didn't understand me, I have to repeat that. For the album and the years that he did. Okay. 1974. The last mile rumble was the last. 1990, 12 shade of Brown original demo record with the release. 1993, 12 shade Brown record with this reissue. 1993, girl with it. Nothing. 1995, Junior High EP. And this one is called 48 and 26 in US and Canada. 1996, Semi Crazy 32 and 39 Peak. 1998, Long Walk Back 32 and 19 US and Canada. 2001, Mesh Bag. 52, Nothing on Canada, 2004, Down Home Come, 73, Only Nothing in Canada, 2005, Great Hit, Nothing, 2005, Life at the Continental Club, The Austin Experience, 2012, Volume 10, Nothing, 2018, Deep in the Heart of Me, Nothing. 2021, He, Hurts, He and Her, Nothing. 
Twenty twenty four the American original nothing. He come with single nineteen ninety three Highway Patrol US country seventy three give with it nineteen ninety five my wife think you're dead sixty eight junior high album junior high and the first one was give with it Venom Wearing Demon, nothing. Semi crazy album. He's hung up. I hung up. You know, I hang up the phone. Well, that's what it is. 1996. It's called nothing. 1997. Gotta sell them chicken. Gotta sell them chicken. With hot. Thompson, uh, the album that we were saying, Hack, Hunt Thompson album. Music video, here we go with that. 1993, Highway Patrol, the better Roger Pistol. My wife, thank you, Dad, Michael Manama. <laughs> Manama. Yes. 1995, Sugar Foot Bank, Roger Pistol. Then after that, Vendom, Wearing Deming, Michael Mado, my Namara. I hang up again, 1996. 409 was uh, the next video with no direct name here. 1997, I got to stop them chicken. Okay. Grammy Award, 1996, you know how, best country album. 1997, my wife think you're dead. Best country song, nominated. Uh, Academy of Country Music Award, 1996, my wife think you're dead. Video of the year, nominated. Country Music Association Award. My wife think you're dead. Video of the year, and he won that. <laughs> I knew, I knew somewhere in the line, this title had to win. My wife thank you that you gotta win. What a tie right there. Yeah. And it did. Okay. So with that, I'm going to finish this autobiography of Union Brown. Yeah, Union Brown. Now I'm gonna read the background information for you guys. Uh, Jameson Brown is a real name that he was born with. He was born June 12, 1952, age 72, from Cottonwood, Arizona, U.S. Now listen to this guy, originally that he belonged in the country music, okay? And this is the industry. That's the country, neo traditional country, a lot of country, country rock, Americana, Americana, Western swing, honky tonk, rockability, rock and roll, rock and roll, soft rock, boogie woogie, <laughs> woogie, boogie woogie. Okay, uh, funny but true. And then occupation musician, singer, songwriter, and actor. I love acting too. Instrumental, gear steel, guitar, live steel, guitar, vocal. Year active, 1960 to the person, cup, telek, 
the website unionbrown.com unionbrown.com that come okay so I finished with this autobiography for you guys now uh, let me show you before I go what it means let me put this picture really big so you can see something very interesting. Okay. Here you see the double neck guitar. Double neck. The top one is supposed to be a regular one. And the bottom one it should be a uh, still, still guitar or something like that. And that's a different and you can see it there uh, in that picture. And this picture too. This one too, you can see there. Double neck guitar. And I didn't know anybody to play double neck guitar until now. Until I read this uh, autobiography for you guys. But, uh, before I go, I would like to ask you to pray for yourself, to pray for your family, to pray for your neighbor, to pray for your country, to pray for the whole world that there is no more pandemic, no more wars, no more corruption. We need to live in peace and harmony and pray in the morning. Meet day, mid afternoon, and before you go to sleep like I'm going to do in a little while, I had to drink my coffee or milk, coffee or milk. Oh yeah, and some people said, oh, you're not going to sleep the whole night. Oh, you're drinking coffee with milk. You're not going to sleep. No, I will sleep if I can drink coffee with milk. I will not, I repeat, I will not go to sleep. Oh no, no way, you know. So I would like to thank you for watching me and hearing me. Oh, look at this. Uh, it's a little better now. Let me show you. See that? It's a little bit better than before. Uh, I'm using uh, some cream and going down a little bit. Hopefully, hopefully uh, this right that I have uh, is with the medicine that I told you the other day, we're working pretty good, but maybe I had to change it, you know. Um, I would like to thank you for watching me and hearing it, like I said before. God bless you guys. And I hope I see you next time on all the podcasts for different Mr. Alice here on YouTube. Bye-bye, guys.